Got your best friend hanging out the arm, though. Got game like I'm dropping me a console. EA Sports coverage of the National Football League brings us to legendary Lambeau Field in Green Bay. Coming up, we've got what should prove to be a good one between the Las Vegas Raiders and the Green Bay Packers. Mason Crosby of the Packers has it teed up, and off we go from Lambeau. Here comes Darius Phillips out of the end zone. And a nice job there on special teams to limit him to inside the 15 as he's dropped at the 14. They'll begin on the ground with Jacobs. And he finds enough of an opening to get this one back up to his 20. Six yards on that last play. Here's second and four. Here's Carr to throw. Oh, you saw that one coming. It's intercepted. Thrown back across his body. Picked up by Jair Alexander. And this return is going to be halted right around the 28-yard line. Man, I wonder if someone's down there checking on the head coach right now because he might be a little bit of shock after what just transpired. Instead of a lengthy opening drive to deal with, this guy stepped up and stole that drive away. Momentum on their side now. How will they attack on offense? And now a throw on first down there, but it's incomplete. They certainly thought he had an open look beyond the first down marker to his receiver, but they just couldn't connect, and that will send them back to the drawing board. Rodgers again here on second and ten. Got a man, that's Lazard. And it's a Packers touchdown. Alan Lazard, 28 yards. And the Packers take the early turnover and convert it into an opening touchdown. Crosby connects on the extra point, and it's now a 7-0 game. For the touchdown, here's Crosby to kick it away. Phillips now from the end zone. And no alley to be found. The coverage was solid, and he's dropped at the 18. The Raider offense set to get this drive started. And the interception on that opening drive winds up leading to the touchdown, so now it's kind of time to start over. Yeah, it certainly is, and his first throw of the game. But I like the way his guys rallied around him. Oftentimes, the quarterback is the leader, right? He tells everyone what to do. In this case, I noticed his linemen around him kind of patting him, saying, let's go, big boy. You're still our leader. A second down pass play there, but it's incomplete. Well, so far on this drive, they've done some good work. They force incompletions on first and second down, bring up third and ten. That brings up the big question. Do they bring pressure or do they play coverage on this down? Got a man open. It's Darren Waller. And he'll be taken down, but not before they reach the 50. So the line of scrimmage all the way up to midfield now as they've got it first and ten. They fake the handoff. Now Carr. And he's caught downfield. It's Waller. And he goes down, but not before getting this inside the 25. Carr with a play fake to Jacobs. That's caught by Waller out left side. And they will eventually get him down, but he's inside the five all the way to the three. And now a timeout coming from the defensive side for the Packers. They'll have two remaining as we step aside here in this first quarter. Two big plays in succession. Not sure this D knows what hit them, but now they got to get ready. It's first and goal. They'll run it with Jacobs, and he is going to lose yardage here. From back at the four, here's second and goal. Now Carr. an extra point away now from tying this ball game. Extra point by Carlson, up and good. And we are tied at seven. Daniel 
So I'll leave it at seven now as they kick it away. Oh, trying to gauge the sun, and he muffs it. And solid field position here to start as they get this out to the 40-yard line. Well, that return gives them a golden opportunity to go out in front. How will the defense respond after giving up that type of a return? About set to get this drive started. The Green Bay offense at the line. And one more time, that's Watkins. First play of the drive going for 14 and a first down. To throw, it's Rodgers. All right, rifles one, and that's going to be intercepted. Jonathan Abram picks it, and the Raiders are going to take possession as they've got it at the 42-yard line. They've got good starting field position as they come up here first and 10 at their own 42. They'll start this drive out on the ground. And he'll be taken down just shy of midfield. Eight yards the tally on that first down run. Here's second and two. Here's Carr rolling to his left. And his throw here is incomplete. Well, they've got man coverage on the outside, and my scouting report on these DBs tells me that they love to take matters in their own hands. They want man coverage, not zone. And there was good coverage there that forced the incompletion. Give them the third down conversion, five yards on the play. On first down, they go with Jacobs again. Oh, he's got a little daylight. And he's going to get this inside the 30. Three tight ends in the ball game here on first and 10. They'll stay on the ground with Jacobs. He'll take it inside the 25. The second and seven with our score tied at seven, but they're planning to change that soon. Only question, will they get three or six out of it? Got a man, it's Darren Waller. Touchdown, Raiders! Darren Waller with a touchdown grab for Derek Carr. And the Raiders have moved out in front. Still first quarter, two receiving touchdowns for him. How are they going to slow him down? I think they're thinking about altering their game plan. Whatever they came in with, now maybe you switch a better cover guy to it. Or you make sure you have more people in his general area, wherever he lines up, to at least try and discourage them from throwing the ball to him. Following the touchdown, ready to kick it away is Carlson. Very short kick. This will be taken by one of the up men. And he'll return this one all the way onto the other side of the field. Well, he gave up the first touchdown of the game, but how about the response? Big time return. Now it's their chance to try and put points on the board. Trying to shake off the interception from the last drive. He'll look to throw. And past the 35, he'll be dropped a yard or two shy of the 30. 14 yards, good for a Packer first down. An ex-teammate used to tell me all the time, I hate experienced quarterbacks because no matter what, you really can't hide what you're doing. And I think that right there, he knew right away where the blitz was coming from, where his primary guy was going to be, and he ended up going to a secondary target for a nice game. I was just going to ask you, that wasn't the primary target. He's so good at that, isn't he? I think he knew right away that he wasn't going to get to his primary guy. I think he read that as soon as he got to the line of scrimmage, knew where the pressure was going to come from, and said, ah, I know how to beat that. And that's what he did. Back-to-back -back good plays have him on the move on first down. Now Rodgers. They're going for Lazard, but this is intercepted. Picked off by Trayvon Mullen. And the Raiders are going to get possession of the football as time will run out on this first quarter of play. We are in for a good one as we're through one on EA Sports. The Raider offense set to get this drive started. They take over here following the interception. That's the good news. The tough spot is the spot that they're in. That's inside the five in the shadow of their own goalposts here. First and ten. The last run got nine. That leaves them with second and a yard. 
car. Out to his left. Looking deep for Adams. Oh, he tries to force it in, and it's intercepted. Picked off by Eric Stokes. And the Packers will have solid field position here as they take over at the 45-yard line. Not the best of plays there as a quarterback. Your right-handed run and left trying to throw it that far downfield. I remember Coach of mine saying, son, that's the equivalent of trying to get the car keys. And Rodgers intercepted a third time. Picked off by Rocky Sin. There he goes, right side. And he takes this one back into the end zone, and the Raider defense delivers a score. Well, it certainly looked to me like he tapped into the quarterback's thought process there, and what I'm hearing more and more when I go around... So many memories that I made on Casket Road.